Thanks for joining us. Our big story tonight, a potential breakthrough for those struggling with their mental health. It impacts so many of us. More Arizonans died by suicide in 2019 than in car crashes. That sobering statistic is the latest available from the state health department. Good evening, I'm Mark Curtis. And I'm Kariba Devine. Researchers based right here in Arizona have found through a study that genes believed to be uh, genes, those genes are believed to be associated with suicide. Team 12's Colleen Sikora shows us how their research could lead to help for those who are really struggling. With something that claims thousands of lives each year, a break can mean lives saved. Every study, it's always a little break. Ignacio Pires, a research assistant professor with TGen here in Arizona, led an international team comparing brain tissue of people who died by suicide versus those who died by natural causes. They found five genes affecting three different regions of the brain that appear to be associated with suicide. These genes, uh, uh, they were showing the same pattern in the different brain regions. Genes associated with things like depression and Alzheimer's. One possible application of these results uh, from one side, it's the one to find some treatment that can lower the risk of uh, suicide. It was just eight months ago. I personally experienced um, a, a suicide of a student in May. Lindsay Taylor, a high school social worker and therapist in the Valley, lost a student to suicide and her son a week later to a fentanyl overdose after mental health struggles of his own. So the idea of getting to a molecular root. I think if this can get more to the roots of it, potentially, that's huge. That would literally be life-saving. Taylor says suicide is complex, noting substance abuse and trauma can have impacts on their own, and suicidal thoughts aren't likely to go away by themselves. If it's something that you start to notice yourself or, you know, your kid starts to express that, I think getting help right away is, is key. Pierce says it's a start for other options to help. Sooner or later, probably we, we can, you know, find something that can help a thousand uh, people. Colleen Sikora, 12 News. Colleen, thanks.